My name is Wei Chen Ling. I come from Taiwan. My robotic experience RoboCup Asia Pacific 2019 in Russia. International Cost Pace Online ICO Challenge Virtual Robot Cup 2020. World Robotic Olympia 2020 in Taiwan. I find learning Cost Pace Robot an interesting experience. Previously, I had thought coding was fun because video games were fun. However, not until I started learning Cospace Robot did I realize that I had been truly naive. Learning Cospace Robot opens another door for me. I constantly learn from trials and errors. But interestingly, I have never thought about giving up. On the contrary, I have been inspired and become willing to solve problems on my own. Law Echo Challenge I was given a chance to prove myself. I had to solve problems on my own. It was not only solve problems, it was bettering the results. I had to map the best route by looking for every possible way, which requires careful calculation and precise coordinates. I was content and confident when I was able to score high. I knew that participating in such activity helped me develop grit and it would pay off the, in the long run. After viewing the sharing videos on LCA Peak Academy YouTube channel, I was most interested in learning from AU7002 Australia region. He was able to explain the whole process in three clear steps. Why, how we fix it, and after fixed. The problem was stated, the solution was given, and the result was provided, all in a clear fashion. I was able to fully understand his way of thinking and use it on my own. I was especially attracted from one of the slide, navigating around walls. I had been stuck when I encountered this challenge. It took me quite a while to figure out my own path. However, AU7002 solution, a star algorithm, was even better. I was amazed by how it was able to calculate the shortest path. Through the videos shared on Echo Challenge YouTube channel, I have learned a lot and understand the importance of sharing experience. Therefore, starting from this summer, I started to share my learning process and knowledge of Cospace and UNT with people who may be interested in them. I hope that more people would like to learn about robotics and AI by sharing my joy and experience. My category of challenge is RCAP Cospace Rescue Challenge U19. At first, I used the good names and positions on the map to decide to use the blue team. To score high, I first think about what would be the right path to allow our robots to save time on walking and avoid using the same routes repeatedly. Because there is a wall blocking in the middle, I choose to use the red path to go into the blue area and get a higher score. And let's picture the red cyan and black lines compose the route of catching the objects when the robot takes the third round of walk it will catch two super objects and go into the deposit area algorithm there are three major functions first jump point second catch two super objects third note that super objects should never be on the other side of the wall for jump point I use three different methods. First, once the robot has taken two black objects in the area with black objects only, it will leave the area. Second, if the robot fails to take any objects along the route, it will leave the area. Third, as soon as the robot treasure chest where the objects are stored and deposited is full, it will jump to the area where it visits before the treasure chest to reduce unnecessary checks. Before the jump point, the robot has to visit 5 points on the road before it deposits objects into the treasure chest. Yeah. 
It only takes one point before depositing the objects in the treasure chest after the jump point. If the robot is on the opposite side of the super object, the pick dot then I set up another area of the robot to visit before visiting the super object. This way, the robot will not be blocked by the wall, which stops it come from catching the super object. Now the X1, Y1, X2, Y2 are used in the algorithm to create the area of the robot to visit before catching the pink down the super object. The robot will move to the three points to catch pink dot the super object easily. The robot will catch two super objects in the round 3 and round 5. It is more efficient and will be able to earn 360 points. The algorithm is that k is the number of rounds. If k divided by 2 equals 0, and k is that 0 and k is less than 5, the following algorithm will be conducted. After that, we can find that the value of k in debug area shows the precise number of rounds when the robot will take super object. Difficulty In the video of session 3 Cospace Rescue U19, JP7083 and TW7132, I made a mistake by jumping into the trap at 4 minutes 51 seconds. I knew that there was a bug in my program while I was making a jump point after gathering two side objects. E? How to overcome? I have two solutions. First, I can set up a few more marks around the trap to avoid jumping into the trap. Second, I can set up the jump point away from the trap area. Thank you.